Welcome back everyone to the channel. We are here with Sparklight episode 4. That's right, 4 episodes into our Let's Play of Sparklight. If you haven't been following along, Sparklight is a roguelite game made by Red Blue Games. I don't know what other games that they have produced. I haven't taken the time to Google search it, but anyway. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun. I've beaten two titans, a couple of vaults, done some upgrades. We're having a great time. If you guys are enjoying it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that way you can be notified when my next great video comes out. Also, if you have a minute, leave me a like and a comment. I will respond, I promise. Uh, before we get into the video, though, I wanted to recognize one of my viewers, JC Fallen. You have been on almost every video, I think, commenting and liking, and I can't say how much I appreciate it. Uh, you're awesome, man. Thanks so much. And with that, let's get into the video. All right, so as you see, I've been farming off cam. Uh, I have 1109 Sparklight. And um, I have uh, found a couple NPCs. This guy you already know about, but this dude over here I found in the acid bogs. I've been through there a bit. I haven't fought the boss yet, I promise, but uh, I didn't want to do any upgrades without you here, but I did want to farm that Sparklight. So that way you guys can see uh, what we get because it's a total surprise to me as well so we're gonna upgrade our uh, widget shop over here because that's 300 and we're going to upgrade uh well whatever this guy is over here so let's check him out let's see so salutations ada thanks for rescuing me but it seems this sky ship can't power my laboratory vessel if i had some spark light i'd start up a laboratory to study organism mutations I don't know what that means, but uh, 100 sparklight? I'm in. Power up the Mobile Zoological Observation Center to enable bonuses against enemies. Deal. 100 sparklight, I'm in. Hey, what do we got? There's some over here. Oh. Uh, we got a beat. Heck yeah. Okay. What do you have here? So, excellent. My ship sails again. Time to resume my studies. I will watch you gather data from your encounters with the creatures below. After I've accumulated enough data on a subject, you'll be able to exploit their weaknesses. Neat. All right, what do we got? Muck blabber. Muck blabber. These are made of muck and byproduct from burning sparklight. You must defeat 160 of these. Would you like me to focus my studies on muck blabbers? No. Let me know if you want me to focus on another creature. I don't really know what I should focus on. Jeez, there's a lot of stuff to do. I've already seen quite a few creatures. Huh. I don't really know. We're gonna be in the... Um... Acid bog, so let's... I don't know. Let's focus on... Let's focus on these little bees. Oh wait, I don't have any bees. I guess we'll focus on... Jeez, I don't even know. Wait, I'm gonna focus on this alien dude. A gooey. These plants expel uh, gelatinous projectiles that bounce. You must defeat. You've defeated 22 of these. Would you like me to focus my studies on gooeyed? Yes. Why not? Excellent. I will get started right away. You should start seeing a small improvement to your damage against this enemy immediately. Yeah. Okay. I guess that's pretty cool. I have collected a couple of beats. Let's go ahead and listen to the song here. Hi, Ada. We're still working eating our song, right? Do you want to hear it anyway? Absolutely. Hooray. Still quite sparse. Come back if you find some more beats. All right. Okay, let's go upgrade our widget shop. Upgrade the shop to unlock more powerful widgets. 300. Deal. Upgrade the widget shop again for 300 more. I could do that. Thanks to you, I'm back in business. Okay. Deal. Whatever you say, man. And down here, I've already upgraded this shop fully. Because I had to get the, um... Uh, this guy right here. I got really chill. Um, the, uh, bubble breather thing. But, um... 
care of this guy. Bubble of Breath safely allows access to aquatic areas that holstered in your belt, so you will always be available. Yeah, another passive one like the Shrinkinator. But I can't upgrade it anymore, so now I just need to find the vaults to get more equipment. We can upgrade our medical facility if we wanted to. It's 500. And I think that's what I'll do, because then I can, it'll expand my tool uh, belt so I can have more stuff. Merge that. Let's just do that. Let's upgrade it 500. It's uh, kind of pricey, but I don't really have any other need for my spark light at the moment. All right, what do we have here? All right, so now let's do that. And that. We don't want the vaults. Let's do the boss so we can go fight the boss in the acid bogs. A little bit more defense, why not? Let's throw a bunch of widgets or um, patches on. Why the heck not? There we go. And a half a heart. Alright, deal. Yeah, I wonder if I can, like. No. I was thinking maybe I could, like, uh, combine these to make, like, one big triangulator. That doesn't seem to be the case. Alright, let's get moving. Not much else to do here. Yep. Wahoo, away we go. Acid bogs are down, so we'll just head that way now. I gotta go this way first. Oh, it's a furnace. We don't want that, so I guess we gotta go back this way. Perfect. Wow, that was quick. There's a... something for me to find. Just some sparkling. Alright. Whatever, I'll take it. Alright, we're in the acid bogs. Okay, here we are. Acid Bog City. Let's find our boss on the map. He seems to be to the left a bit and down. So let's, uh, let's head there. All right, so these guys I have extra damage against, let's see. Okay, nice. I don't know what, what's doing better, the damage boost or the research, but it's something, I guess. Oh, it still hurt me. Oh, I forgot about these guys. Wish I didn't get hurt after I kill him. Oops. Keep uh, holding down the button too long, and it does a a hammer pound, and that's not what I want. Oh, I can get these now because I got the uh, the lung. Sweet. Those flowers kill you. They keep exploding on me, and that's just not fun. Just avoid those guys. Wait, it got me through the zone? That's crazy. Anything over here for me to get? Okay, the boss is just up a uh, tile. Oh. Here we go. We even got a heart out of that. Nice. Easy. All right, so here's the boss. Let's go. All right, what uh, what gadgets do we have here? 
RD boost fortifies your defense, reducing the amount of damage you take for a short duration. Scatter bombs, lights. What do we have currently equipped? Wait, what the heck? Oh, that was the hardy boost. Okay, I'm smart. Okay, uh, we'll just use a hardy boost and just take less damage. Scubert, ironclad titan. Right, what do we got? Let's do the hardy boost. Bomber guy. The hardy boost didn't last long at all. It really changes the pattern. That's interesting. So far, not too bad. I'm doing okay. He's gonna shoot with the lasers. Oops, ouch. Yeah, this guy seems pretty dang easy. I don't know, like, is it my higher defense or more damage or it's just easier attacks. It's just this guy's not much of a challenge. Oh please don't kill me because I can't move. <laughs> I got stuck in his laser. Oh man, that was just dunk. Alright, what do we got? We got a little vial here. I don't know what this does. Muckbuster, piece of Titan scrap that's been repurposed as an upgrade to Wingnut. Take control and bust that muck. Alright. Yeah, that guy was super easy. I promise I, I didn't actually fight him before, I promise. He just, I have defense boosters and damage boosters, so I guess that made him a lot easier, so. All right, Wingnut, Dust Buster, or Muck Buster, or whatever you get. Uh, oh, he's a little vacuum cleaner. Yeah, good job, buddy. I don't know what that does. What do these do? Oh, spark light. Nice. Just free spark light. I guess the muck is spark light, so it's just doing like a, a cleanup. Alright, well, I did it. That's funny. Scanning. The world cannot sustain life without land from which life could spring. So the geologist, with her knowledge of tectonics, cast the world in sand and stone. But as with all living things, a world must be able to adapt. Fractures in the crust world allow the land to shift when under stress. You've activated the Geologist's seal. Well done, Starborn Child. The force of the Foundation Stone is still strong, but it is beginning to weaken. With each fracturing, the Baron gets closer to seizing its power. If the Foundation Stone falls into his hands, he will be able to reshape the world for his own gain. You must not let the Baron obtain the stone. The world depends on you, Ada. Two seals remain. Make haste, Starborn Child.
Way to go shutting down that ironclad titan, such an abomination. The next titan is located in the Sinking Sands, west of the, Vi the Vinelands. Make that your next destination. Deal. Okay, I don't have a whole lot of patches or anything else to really add to the situation, so probably just move on. You can't add these together, which I find strange, but that's okay. Right, let's um, switch to Vault Triangulator. There we go. How much to upgrade the shop again? Let's see. Upgrading the medical facility to level 4 will increase the size of your patch board for a thousand spark light. One thousand. That's 200. Another hundred and... Okay. Yeah. So far I don't really need those upgrades, so... Hello, Ada. Perfect spot, blah blah blah. Yep, okay. I'll give him a wall of him. Okay, that was really quick for, uh, you know, that fight. So let's uh, gather up these widgets here and go... Party boost. Oh, I have to pick one or the other. Oopsie. Okay, whatever. Uh, let's head to the next area and see if we can find the vault. Wahoo, away we go. Okay, so, it uh, seems pretty obvious now that uh, each section that you go to um, opens up the path forward for the next area. So it's, you know, I guess that seems pretty obvious now, but... Uh, yeah, I was trying to find my way in a couple episodes ago, and it just didn't make any sense. Oh, that's right. Um, this is actually the same area as before, because we didn't die, so it didn't reset. We've already explored this. Yeah, we just gotta go left. Or west, as they say in the game. Yeah, down is the, the bog. Ah, here we go. So, yeah, so we have the one switch here, obviously. Now we use uh, Wingnut to... Uh, Suck up the junk. Yeah. Gross. There we go. Here we are. Oh. Oh, talk. Hey. Hey, I never thought I'd see another racer down here. They call me Rocky the Rocket, the fastest guy in all of Geodia. Well, that that's what they used to call me. The Baron's Mining has run off most of my competition. Hey, are those rocket boots? No way, they're as fast as Rocky's custom Super Spark Booster Pack. What do you say, in for a race? Uh, sure. Wahoo, I'll put up a finish line on your map. Enough chit-chat, let's race. Jeez, that was pretty quick. Oh, I gotta, where's my map? Not really winning. I don't feel like I'm getting much boost out of my boosters. He's just he's just eating me. I'm getting almost no progress. Actually I'm thinking I'm going slower. Ugh. Too bad. Not an, not everyone can be as fast as Rocky. I've got to recharge, but then you'll find me again after the next fracture. I'll be ready for a rematch. Alright. I think I just gotta get an upgrade to the boosters or something because that was not really that great. And I left a beat behind at the entrance. Wonder if I get like a speed boost widget or something. Alright, let's go back and collect that beat after I click this. Oh, this guy shoots stuff. Okay, okay, okay. Holy moly. Let's just go click the beat before I die. Good lord. Our boy, the beat. Hooray! Okay, I kind of want to go to the vault too. The vault is back this way, so we'll we'll find it. Let's just kill these guys if I can. Oh, 
Dang it. Oh, ouch. Well, I died. <laughs> Whoopsie. But we got the beat. That's what matters. Okay. Right, we got the Adreno boost and the Invigor boost. Let's take the health. Oh, should I upgrade? No, I want to get. I want to save my spark light for when I get the uh, gadget down here. The schematic. Well, I haven't picked up any of the... Oops. I haven't picked up any of the muck right here. Let's see if there's anything good here. Or is it just free spark light? I'm gonna upload this guy. Nope. Well, nothing special, just free spark light, I guess. There's there's that. Alright, well let's head to the uh, shifting sands. Finding a bunch of stuff, but oops. Not really finding our way to the shifting sands. Where are we at? So we gotta go down more. Just skip us to the shifting sands. Now. Alright, here we are at the shifting sands. Thanks for waiting. So let's find us a vault. Alright. Down this way, what it looks like. Three or four screens, and then. new yeah three or four screens and then we go up but it looks like we're just like at a wall so as soon as I can go up I guess that's where we'll go oh there's no enemies that I've noticed which is strange maybe that's not the vault for this one that must be the vault north maybe I guess that must be that vault then i will go the one that's south Oh my gosh. And these guys don't play around. They have like stuff all over. Oh, I ran right into one. I stay at like five o'clock or Seven o'clock, they can't hit me. All right, deal. Well, here's a furnace. I'm really more interested in. 
uh, the vault so we can get the new schematic. We can find that just really fast. Oh no, it's coming right for me. Whew. <laughs> Alright, so the vault should be right here. Excellent. Oh, there's a chirp. Or a beat. Keep saying chirp. Alright, what do we have here? Spark Blitzer. A unique device with two spark-like capacitors fused together. Handling the energy transmission of this gadget might require some finesse. Alright. Well, that's okay. Looks like I gotta, I gotta equip it first. Okay, so X to shoot this boy. Okay, so far so good. Okay. Okay, pretty instantaneous. The spark launcher only does it, like, really, uh, takes a long time for it to go, but the spark blitzer is, like, immediate. Your epiphany, spark blitzer. You've reverse engineered the spark blitzer. You can assemble it in the workshop. Cool. All right. We've accomplished that. Now let's go fight some of them big boys so I can start the research on them to make it easier for me to kill them. But I gotta kill one first, I think, so probably should focus on just beating one first. Okay. Okay, so we, this is a pretty open type of map, which is neat. Not a whole lot of restrictive areas like the last few. Okay. As long as you don't get pounded by them, they're pretty easy to dodge, as long as you're paying attention. Oh, oh dang it. Okay. Well, I have some uh, Invigo boosts, so let's use one of those. We've successfully beat one of those guys. Oh, we got some here. A little spark light. Nothing too special. Okay, so now I can activate this with my... Oh, I don't have the gun yet. That's right, I need to actually activate it, so... Let's just do some exploring, see if we can get every square inch of this place. Here's our buddy. Let's do some gambling. Today's your lucky day. We have an exciting game for you to play here on Monty's Hall. I'll just need to see your crew card to get started. Welcome back. Thank you for being a member of Monty's Hall. Today's game will cost you 10 spark light to play. You want to try your luck? Yeah. Wahoo. All right, here's how you play. Open one of the big chests here and you have big reward. All right, I'm just gonna keep opening the right one until it works. Not so fast before you pick. How about I make this bit easier? I'll open one of these empty ones. You sure you wanna open that chest? Yeah? Better luck next time. <sighs> I'm not sure you can win. Like by by sure probability, I should have been, at least been able to open one. So we've been here. Just keep going on the right side then. I don't have the thing for that either, so I guess we'll have to come back. Ouch. Those guys seem pretty easy to just kind of stand there.
But you can trap these guys between areas. That's kind of cheating. Oh, kamikaze, dude. No. <laughs> yeah, these are in our Adreno boost. Still ended up getting hit. Thought I was at the right spot. Keep uh, putting myself in the wrong spot. I'll get it right. There's a lot of empty space in this area. Just like there's nobody around. Where's that? Where's that beat at? Oh, there he is. I got you, buddy. Welcome. Yeah, there's just a lot of empty space, not a whole lot of mobs, it seems like. They're a bit more powerful than I would be accustomed to, but not that bad. Okay. Ah, blow up your buddy. <laughs> There's so much happening here. Ow. Oh no. Here. Blow up yourself. Oh, it doesn't blow up? It doesn't hit him? That's not fair. Oh, ow. Jeez. That guy's weird to fight. Half a heart left. How far can we make it? I don't want to go down that way. Oh, there's still more to see, I guess. We could go that way. Do I have any health? Spark, timed, pop light, scatter bomb. Nope. No health. Welcome. There's a tree I can whack. Maybe it has health. Oh, just spark light. It's still good. We're almost up to. A thousand again, we're doing pretty good. Oh. Where are these boys? Can progress. Two, three, four. Oh no! That means a hammer swing. Five. Here we go. This guy's definitely gonna kill me. Dodge too soon. There it is. Hmm. Let's go ahead and do some upgrades on things. Oh, let's uh, make our uh, our new uh, schematic. 
Epiphany Spark Blitzer. 200. Let's go ahead and invent it. Hey. Only one more to get. Alright, let's check out this boy over here. It's the center of it. These beasts are conjured from the environment and use their immense strength to send shockwaves through the earth. You defeated one of these. Would you like me to focus my studies on the revenant? Yes. Should see a damage increase right away. Perfect. Those things are probably the biggest difficult uh, monster in the area, so makes sense. Let's listen to our excellent song. Awesome. <laughs> you have gotten great. Gold Resilience Patch. Increases maximum health by one heart. Come back after you find some more beats. Thanks. Let's go add that to the, uh, the old board here. Don't need that much energy, so we'll just take that off and put this one on. Damn. Awesome. Alright, now we can upgrade this guy for 500. Deal. Founder's Ankh. I don't know what that does. Instantly activates when defeated, reviving you for a second chance. Oh, that's cool. Instantly activates. Yep, yep, yep. That's done. Got it. Okay, guys. Well, I think that's it for today's episode. Uh, thanks for coming along with me. If you really enjoy my content, please, please hit that subscribe button and notify bell there so you can be notified when my next video comes out. Uh, leave a like and a comment. And don't forget that... I stream every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, barring holidays, since uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas are coming up, so I may not actually be here on Friday, but we'll see. Anyway, I'm really glad to see you guys here, and we'll see you in the next one. Yeah.